Hello, it's Wednesday, May 12th, 2010, and I'm Martin Smith with a daily outlook from Maxiforex. The dollar finished mixed versus the majors as equity markets gave back some of their gains after investors started to question whether the EU's massive bailout plan will be effective. Nasdaq gained by 0.03% and Dow Jones declined by 0.34% as concerns about the ability of the EU countries to end their debts grew. Crude weakened by minus 1%, closing at $76 a barrel, and gold gained by 1.65% to close at $1,230 an ounce, as the EU's massive rescue package didn't ease investors' concerns. Today, trade balance is expected with minus 40 billion versus minus 39.7 billion prior. Crude oil inventories are expected with 1 million versus 2.8 million prior. The euro declined versus the dollar over made more concerns that the $1 trillion loan package won't end the region's spreading debt crisis. Overall, the the euro dollar traded with a low of 126.22 and a high of 128.03. The euro dollar's main trend is downwards and oversold daily RSI conditions could suggest a retracement is near. Today, German prelim GDP is expected unchanged with 0%. The pound gained versus the dollar after the Conservatives' Cameron was appointed the new Prime Minister following Gordon Brown's resignation. Manufacturing production came out stronger than expected with 2.3% versus 0.3% forecast. The pound dollar is still on a downward trend and as long as the pair is below the 151 level and the 50-day moving averages, it remains bearish. Today, the BOE inflation report will be released and Governor King will speak in London. The yen gains slightly versus the dollar after renewed concerns about the EU bailout plan. Overall, the dollar-yen traded with a low of 92.21 and a high of 93.26. The dollar-yen is facing strong resistance at 94 and 94.50. The Canadian dollar continued gaining versus the dollar before today's economic data, which likely suggests that Canada will be able to raise its interest rates before the US. Overall, the dollar CAD traded with a low of 101.49 and a high of 102.88. The dollar CAD resumed its downtrend after being unable to cross above the 200 daily moving averages. No economic data is expected today. That's it from me. Be sure to visit us at maxiforex.ru.